So tonight we have a uh, Amazon haul. I do have a couple more things coming tomorrow. Um, I have my totes that I'm going to organize my room with. They'll be here tomorrow. And then another portion of what I have gotten today will be here tomorrow as well. Um, I did get a shipment of resin in. Uh, I ordered some resin. I don't do a lot of resin, as you can imagine. This is a brand I have been buying. Uh, it's called Epoxy. It's like $44 for the two bottles like this size. And I've had some really good luck with this recently. Um, it's on Amazon. It's called Epoxy. I, you know, I go through a lot of resin. Would I like to buy Let's Resin, T-Expert, J-Diction, all those? Yes, I would. Do I have the money to buy all those? No, I don't. Um, granted, some are only 10 or $20 more for the same amount of resin, but if I buy those, then do I buy, what else do I get to buy, you know? Because I live on a limited budget, so uh, YouTube pays me, but YouTube doesn't pay me a lot, so not near as much as what I spend, but that's my choice. I choose to do this. I love doing this. This is my craft. This is my passion, so... Um, I started buying, I found this resin, like I said, it's very inexpensive, but it does work really well. I don't hardly ever have any bubbles. If I do, I throw it on my resineers machine for just a few minutes, and they're gone. Uh, I did that tray last night, and the time before that, I don't know what resin I used, but I don't think it was the same one, but I had bubbles all around the edge, so this time I didn't. So, um, that's a big plus. So, first of all, I'm going to show you what I got from Amazon. Um, I got this turtle mold here. I'd been seeing it before, and I'm like, I wanted a turtle mold, but I wanted one that didn't have the designs in the shell. It just had a standard turtle shell. And this one has just a standard turtle shell. Uh, he's got some big, beautiful eyes. You can see his mouth. Uh, he's got very, very big flippers here, so I'm excited to try him. Again, I got him on Amazon. Uh, I got a mold. I got, I'm going to call this Daniel Cooper's mold. Uh, this is a mold that he uses all the time. I got this because I have some bronze cabochons. Not cabbage on bronze bezels, closed back bezels that I've always wanted to buy cabbage on to put in it. And I believe this one here is the exact size. Hang on, they're right here behind me. Let me grab them. Actually, it might be the next size up. Yep, oh, these right here. So these are going to be the ones that are going to fit in here. And this is the mold that he uses, of course, to do all of his techniques in. I love, did you see his video today, guys? Did you see his video today? It was pretty spectacular getting to see what happens with the Petri dish effect from the other side. Getting to see it actually do its thing. That was pretty cool. And the fact that he used, a, he went through a lot of effort to pull that video off. Uh, as someone who films their videos daily, that's what he did was not an easy task. So... I appreciate him doing that. I thought it was really neat to see. But yeah, I wanted to get this mold. I don't have it. I don't know why I don't have it. I have, have every other mold in history, probably. But I didn't have that one. Did not have that one. Okay, let me put this in here. You know what, I'm not even going to put it in there. Because I'm going to use it before long, so. It will get used. I'm going to mess with putting it there. All right. I got these because I have seen a couple resin artists. I believe DNA resin. Uh, she has them. They're the acrylic popsicle sticks. The sparkly ones. And I have seen her use these. And I'm like, these are awesome. in there pretty cool and see I like using 
my sticks over and over again. But when you get to a certain point like these, that you can feel the splinters on them as you rub your fingers across them. So these are going to be very, 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 very handy. So I'm excited for those. Excited for those. Oh. All right. Now, if you remember my dragon eye notebook, this is a paper that I got. Um, it is like a brown craft paper. And there's several bags of it here. I think there's three packs of it. Oh, maybe just two. But there's a lot of sheets in here. And it's non-lined, so you can use it to sketch on. I'm going to use it to sketch on. I might even do a drunk journal on it. I don't know. Uh, but my three rings, I ordered a bunch of those. They will be here tomorrow. No, Sunday. They'll be here Sunday. So... Now, I got another mold here. And, uh, I thought this would be a fun one to do. It is the Let's Resin Paper Towel Holder Mold. It's a pretty good sized mold here. And, uh, I don't have a good paper towel holder in here for my paper towels or in my kitchen, really. I have one of those metal Dollar Tree ones. And I was going to do where they used to stick it in a base, but then I saw this and I was like, you know what? We're going to do this instead. Now, usually, let's resin puts on here. Here we go. 12 point... 12 fluid ounces. 12 point something fluid ounces. So, it's a lot of resin. But I do have some deep pour resin because it is very deep. It's not very thick, but it is deep. And um, I do have some deep pour resin that I won in that contest. So that's some, one of those things. I saw that and I was like, oh, I want it so bad. <laughs> so I got that. Also got me some new gloves. I have not tried them yet to see if they fit. Gloves are always kind of weird. Because if I get small, they're so tight, I have a hard time getting them on and off. But if I get large, I'm mean, get medium. They're usually too big. Let's see what we got here. Yeah, they're not bad. They're a little bit big. I got medium. They're a little big, but not. Not bad enough, I can't work with them. So, those will work perfect. And I can get them on and off if I don't use... If I don't mess them up, I can take them on and off. And the others are so tight, I can't get them off and on. So. Alright. That's it on my Amazon haul. Besides my resin, like I said, I got two bottles of that resin. And it comes with cups and all of that fun stuff, just like most of the other resins do. Now, I have a small Dollar Tree haul as well, and uh, Marilyn, if you watch, I looked, I looked for some more of those tablecloths, that rainbow one, Marilyn had reached out to me and said she couldn't find them at her Dollar Tree, we went today, and me and my friend went over there, and I looked today, and couldn't find any at all, so, uh, I will keep an eye out next time I go, to see if they have any, but we did look. I bought me a small whisk for the mix to mold. I got me, I got a box. I want to do something with this. Something with this and resin, I think. I think we're going to resin it. Uh, I got, I don't know what it is about Dollar Tree stamps. I love their stamps, and these stamps are so cool. So I got some more Dollar Tree stamps. First, I got some more of the baby wipes. These are the 99% water. I really like these. I said they're going to leave everything feeling greasy and sticky. 
using the sticky. And I think I have a couple more items here. Okay. This one here, when I bought it, the first thing I thought of was Claire. <laughs> I thought of Claire. If you've been watching Claire's recent videos, she is 100% on a 90s, 80s and 90s. Uh, style, design, <laughs> you name it, whatever you want to call it. 80s and 90s style design. And it's these fluorescent. And here they are. And they are tattoos. So how cool is that, right? I thought that was pretty cute. Here's a cassette player. <laughs> she was, she thought that was funny. I messaged her the, after she did the one with the cassettes and told her that Ren has a cassette tape. He made his latest album on cassette. I actually have my cassette player right here. And I bought his cassette. But I also went on eBay and bought me a whole bunch more too. I'm actually going to buy the next size bigger boombox probably next month. I kind of want a little bit bigger one because that one's not very loud. And I can hook my headphones up to it. But uh, because that one is... That one you can only hook them up like manually. And I have... I just like bigger one. I like more, more speakers. More sound there. So yeah, we got 35 color tattoos. Didn't look like 35 tattoos. Is there two sheets here? No, oh, it says one set. Okay, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 32. Oh, unless they're counting this separate and that. Even then, it's 33, 34. Yeah, maybe 35. Okay. But yeah, I thought those were cute. I thought those just. <laughs> Tom, the first thing I thought of, like I said, I thought of Claire doing all of her bright fluorescent colors with the cassette tapes and the, all the fun stuff. All right, yeah, come on. Okay, and I got this one because I was like, they're wall decals, but I'm gonna use them, I think, in a tray or something. Um, somebody that likes the office. <laughs> I have the entire, look at them. I have the whole set here. How funny is this, right? It's the Dunder Mifflin logo yeah i've seen several episodes i can't say i was like crazy huge fan of the office but i thought in case i there's a lot of people that are like diehard office fans so i thought how fun would this be to do a big tray and maybe put all the characters in there <laughs> just fun just fun all right guys well that's it for tonight i don't have like i said it's not a huge haul um, I did get a few things and I'm excited. So if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed, why not? What's the hold up guys? I'm here all the time. What's the hold up? <laughs> um, I'm excited to pour this. I really am. Uh, it, because I'm going to use my deep pour resin, it's probably going to take two or three days for it to here fully i don't want to put it on the heat mat i'm just gonna i'm gonna do something fun with it i don't know i haven't decided what yet exactly but we will be doing something fun 
So I hope everyone has a wonderful night. I hope your resin cures beautiful. Your craft projects turn out amazing. I hope you are all happy, healthy, safe, and blessed. And I will see you guys tomorrow night. Bye.